Times, how's everybody doing? Good. Make some noise for yourselves one more time for coming out to support this event from Dubai to Damascus. <clears throat> I got a lot of friends here, a lot of fam here. It's a beautiful thing. And you know, speaking of Damascus, shoot us. Honestly? Really? How Arab are you, bro? <laughs> By the way, make some noise for Firas, our DJ tonight. <laughs> he heard some silence, he's like, oh, Firas? <laughs> I'm never gonna forget that one. Yo, can you open this up? Make some noise for Shannon. Just a side note. These lovely young ladies right here just graduated from Northwestern University in Qatar School of Journalism. They put together two fantastic documentaries about hip-hop in the Middle East, one called Broken Records, another one called? Lyrics Revolt. Lyrics Revolt, you can check them out online. Support local hip-hop, support the hip-hop of this region because it is the voice of our generation. Now, I was talking about Damascus and it's one of the longest continuously inhabited cities on planet Earth. Given that hip-hop is this urban culture, more specifically the street culture, I always thought it was cool to represent one of the oldest urban and street experiences in the world. And so I wrote something to commemorate one of the most beautiful places in the old city. It's called Straight Street. Can I recite it for you tonight? Yeah. Now, I know I'm a mellow guy generally, but I also just got off a 17-hour flight, so I'm really mellow right now. You have to forgive me. But uh, I took a stroll down a street called Straight. Met a medicine man about a third of the way. Predecessor to the pusher man with something to say about an apple a day keeping the sickness away. I valued his advice at face at first. Till he enlightened me to how precisely nature works. Giving us citrus fruits in wintertime for vitamin C. Just met each other, but I'm already invited for tea. SubhanAllah. His fate would have it. He and I turn out to be related. A small world's even smaller when you're Arab, ain't it? Made it a point to soak in all his information about regenerative meditations and preventative medication Like a modern Ibn Sina with a pretty calm demeanor And a remedy for everything that plagued the Arab nations Yet when asked to how to cope with our impossible fate He just said follow the middle path to a street called And so I It's gonna take a little while, you got two minutes That's not what he said I took a stroll down a street called Straight, met a spiritual teacher about two-thirds of the way. Predecessor to the preacher man with something to say about a prayer every day keeping the Satans at bay. He spoke of angels on our shoulders and the angles of our solar systematic self-destruction, metaphysical corruption with a danger to our polar ice caps till it's out of our control and in the hands of our beholder. We philosophized for over 20 minutes like that. Taught me lessons, any questions he would give him right back. Said the answers were within us, and I didn't like that. But I realized later why he did it like that. See, I had so much more to learn. The clock was ticking, couldn't stall. Committed his words to memory. His wisdom wasn't thralling it when asking him. What was the most important to recall? He just said, follow the middle path, straight street, and that is all. And so I took a stroll down a street car. Straight. Stay on beat, please. Took a stroll down the street called Straight. Met a carpenter hard at work at the end of the way. Predecessor to the architect with something to say about not doing tomorrow what should be finished today. So he manipulated wood and metal till it followed function, building off through via rector. Cardo Maximus Junction, something told me he was wise beyond his years. I had a feeling from the way that he'd exposed the beams of ornamented ceilings with an ambidextrous half. Now she'll lightly jest and laugh, saying that my Western education made it hard to grasp this connection to the past, deep rooted in his craft. But was more than willing to share with me these things he knew I lacked, and for that I would be grateful. Learning how to Build the monumental for the playful and the humble for the faithful. You can ask how we stack against our impossible odds. He just said, follow the middle path, the straight street to Allah. Make some noise for yourselves, yo. <laughs> yes, for us. You can play it now. Oh, wow. This one right here is called Destiny. Feel free to sing the hook along with me. If you like. Yeah, it's hard living in the West when I know the East got the best of me set. In my eyes, but you never really see the rest of me now. Now can you hear me, my city? Bilingual's what I'm blessed to be here. 
ما تسلام افتحي اجنحتك وطيري ايه ايه وين الوعي وين امشوا معي هين بين الجبلين عين حب الطرفين اما هدنا حب ذاتنا مو عجب هدنا سبات هذا الحكي بين اخواتنا زين العرب والامريكان الله يرحم كل اخواتنا اغاني مثل ما هات ما اذا 